What's going on everybody? Today I am playing Blood Hunt. It's a basically a battle royale, but it's all vampires and stuff. I I I, I don't know. It's it's not a great game. It's kind of unique, I guess. I mean, you can you can pick like the, yeah, let me go into it. You got ar arch types, so you got like the brute, self-explanatory, vandal. It's got like a really high jump thing and then like you punch the air and then the shock wave affects people uh saboteur uh you can become invisible and prowler does the same thing uh siren um they can suck blood faster like the amount of time it takes to suck a human clean is faster um send out a project projection and then you warp to that projection and then Enforcer, uh, they harden their skin to deflect bullets and stuff. It's all it's all pretty much the same crap. Um, I usually, as you can see, I played the most with Prowler. just because I like the invisibility stealth aspect. But I was trying to get all the trophies. That's also not what my guy looks like. Like, I customized all these characters. Let me see if I can... Yeah, see, this is what my, my Vandal looks like. For some reason, I have to go to customization to see it. Yeah, I tried to, to be kind of unique, but I don't know. There's there's such little customization options that it's it's basically worthless. And I'm not paying for the battle pass for a game like this because I, I I'm not gonna play it often unless people want to see me play it. Like unless you guys want to see me play this, I probably won't be playing it again. But I will. Like there's little challenges you can do here and there. But, uh, for the most part, it's pretty self-explanatory. Like, this is the big community area. Go here to change the game mode. I haven't played ranked. I played, like, one match of Battle Royale, because these, these two are new. I've mainly been playing solo Blood Hunt, which I'll, I'll start that first. Let's get in the queue for matchmaking. We'll see how it goes. Uh, not a huge fan that I have my controller muted, but it's still picking up the little controller sounds. There's probably a way I could fix that. I don't know how to do it. I probably do. I just don't remember. I don't know. But I'm not going to do it. This mic is... Uh, this is a very good microphone. Can you hear all of the little clicks of my voice? It's almost like it's... uh, What are those things? The ASMR. ASMR. <laughs> also, I keep like instinctively looking up in the corner... Uh, you just, every time my eyes go up there, I'm looking at my monitor where, I, like, making sure that my the screen looks okay and that the audio is coming through clear, and there's no clipping or anything. And I keep my my my, uh, my uh, camera is right in front of my face, along with with the microphone. So if you see me looking up there, I'm not. I don't have something wrong with me. I'm just <laughs> I'm looking at my computer computer monitor. All right, well, that screen is where you were supposed to pick where on the map you want to spawn. I'm going with this guy, because whatever. I'm also not great at this game. It controls very weird. Like, the, the the way you run and turn, it's it's almost like there's a delay, but there's not. I mean, you can, you can, if you're used to playing games like this, but the way that I move, you can probably make out what I'm talking about. Uh, like... See, see what I mean? Like, you're running this way, and then you run that way, and it, you, you, like, you're running this way, sprinting, and then I just cut immediately left. It stops you. Like, it's not, there's no, like, linear movement. It's, it's very, this is me just moving the controller in a perfect circle. Somebody already found me, so this, this was fun. <laughs> I'm already dead. Because <laughs> I was showing... <laughs> Yeah, see, that's one of the, the melee weapons you can get. They're these two, like, like wind swords, almost. They're they're pretty sweet. I'm, I don't really use melee weapons in this. Um, maybe I should, because I get killed by them a lot. Um, yeah, so you get one respawn, and then some... You use your little predator vision or whatever, this thing. It's basically eagle vision from Assassin's Creed. Not very original. Uh, but if you find... There's humans scattered around the map. And if you find them 
and one of them has like you could see their heart through their chest uh, that one those guys will give you if you suck their blood they will give you one extra life you can only have one extra life banked up but if you if you have zero you can see it up top right corner there uh, and see some of these guys this will increase melee damage I don't use melee so I'm not gonna suck that one the other crazy thing is if someone sees you sucking the neck of somebody yeah see this one lower cooldown of earth shock which I believe is my jumping the one that lets me like jump super far what does this guy do yeah see he'll give me an extra life so you just suck their blood now I have an extra life again uh, I'm gonna yoink these guys because they drop burst rifles which are decent and they're blue but these are just uh, like a little NPCs but oh there we go that's never mind that's better uh, the the weapons that you ooh wait golden chest gotta get this purple something give me a purple weapon oh my I've never used this before as a minigun I've I don't know I don't know how good this is but definitely giving it a shot uh, uh, yeah, that's good. Let's see how we're... Oh! Gotcha. Do I have... Let me just... Oh, yeah, and you can... There's something called Diablerize, where you, you basically... It's basically feeding, but when you do it to a another enemy like a like an actual person in the game um you i forgot what it does it, it must I think it like heals you more or something i don't know all right finally some armor uh sorry about the dogs they are b -b barking okay i got some armor on now where are we at here Oh, we're way down at the bottom. Usually, I like to be a little str strategic with games like this, but I'm just going to run and try to find some people. Hopefully, Burning Church. Nice. Love the aesthetic. Okay. Jumpity jump rooftops. Oh, and they have, um, actually, the revolver is, is a pretty good gun. It's, it's, it's powerful, but it's slow firing, obviously. Uh, what else is really good? The crossbow, like the the regular crossbow, uh, shoots a dart that has like it emits like poison gas and does uh, AOE. And the miniature crossbows, you get two of them. You do yeah, right here, these things. Uh, I'll just take those and and see if I can get a kill with them. Basically, they're just uh, explosive tipped arrows, but there's two of them, so I guess it makes up for. I don't know. Dual pistols? No, thank you. I'm not a huge fan of the pistols in this. Um, I'm not... I'm I'm really not great at this. I've had some games where I've gotten like five or six kills, but those are rare. And I think I've only won like two or three games solo. I don't really play with, uh, with randoms, because... I don't know. It's just annoying. And, uh... Oh, wait a minute. What is that? Oh, is this just the color of the roof? I think so. Yeah. Oh, wait, is this the club? There's a club in here that, uh... Oh, hello. Can't use you. There's a club in here where there's, like, a bunch of music playing. And you can go in, and it's, like, super loud. So it's, it's cool to go in there sometimes. Uh, like, if you're getting chased by someone or something, because they can't hear footsteps or hear anything over the music. So if you can get in the building and uh, secure a nice hiding spot. It's pretty solid. But this is not the area that I thought it was. I don't want a Tommy gun. What do you got? What do you got for me? Uh, soaring leap. That's the jumping one. So Earth Shock is the one where I slam... I got. I, I get the Earth Shock one confused with the... There's one where you punch the air and it knocks people back. I think that's the one the Brute has. And then there's Earth Shock where you punch a surface and it creates a shockwave. That makes more sense. Uh, cooldown. Yeah, I use this one a lot more. Ah, uh, see, okay, so someone saw me feeding. I think it was that one over there. Saw me feeding. And now I'm. The people. The enemies in the game can see me through the wall. 
So other players can see me now through walls. There's like a red icon. And if you can see up on the mini map there, it's blinking. So until that cool that cooldown meter runs down, uh, I am a sitting duck. Just hopefully there's nobody who's really near me. I am kind of towards the edge. So I, I, I might be safe until the cooldown is done. One thing I do like is the the running, like the running up walls. It's very, very much like, kind of like how the Hulk traverses buildings and stuff. Just really like beastly. Okay, um, we're gonna we're gonna hop on this way. I can't believe I haven't seen one person, and there's what 20 people left. And you know what's crazy right now? I'm pretty sure the reason the dogs are barking right now is because there's... I think there might be a bear in the garage right now. Either that it's the, or it's the neighbor. Not 100% sure. I'm gonna stay still for a second here. Just two seconds. I'll be right back. I'm just gonna see if there's a bear in my garage. Alright, I am back. Um, was not... A bear. It was our neighbor going through his tools in the old gay rash. So. I cannot believe there hasn't been one. Now there's 16 people left. Still not a single person. When I go back and look at the footage, I'm going to see if. If anyone has come into the sight line while I stepped away. This is crazy. I think this is the longest I've ever gone without seeing a single person. Which is going to be real fucking boring for whoever's watching. <laughs> oh, super jump. Oh. Okay. Not seeing anybody. Now there's 13 people left. I don't even hear gunshots. Where are all of these people? Let's go. Oh. I like that. You can like you can jump while in midair. Not very realistic, but we're vampires, right? <laughs> okay, here we go. More ammunition. Bibbidi boobity. Liberty bibbity. Um <laughs> Jump up. The, oh, I like that too. There's some, there's some like little traversal things that are pretty cool, like the whole sliding on the wall. It's very uh, Assassin's Creed Unity like. But and like you know when you when you jump down from a high place, does that creates like a little shockwave. It's cool. Like there's a lot of really cool elements to the game, but for some reason it just does not draw you in. I ooh. That is literally, that's crazy. I've never seen this, and that is literally my favorite composition uh, for classical music, is uh, Mozart's Requiem. Very, very good. This dude predicted his own death and made it a song. <laughs> uh, okay, but anyway. Dude, there's eight people left. And I'm in the middle of the, the whole fucking thing now. How have I not seen one person? Watch, I'm the, I'm the first person I see, they're gonna fucking kill me. I know it. It's gonna happen. I've spoken it into existence. Oh. I feel like I hear somebody. No. Maybe that was just me. Okay. Go over here. Anybody? Seven people left. Where are these seven people? Oh! Oh! There it is. God. It sucks. I can't even... I can't even really hear footsteps like I'm used to. I should be wearing the headphones. Um... So that sucked. Good thing I sucked that other person. And got their extra life. Like, uh, is that person gonna give me? No, they're not an extra life one. Oh, I'm not in a good area. Ooh boy. Uh, can't do anything with that. I got no armor. 
Okay, I'm kind of, you know, I'm just going to cheese. I'm going <laughs> to, I'm going to hug the edge of the red. Just keep my eyes out, eyes open for m and &E's. Oh, somebody's up there. I'm going to go see if I can get my hands on him. He's back on the roof. Man, I I am just terrible. Golly. This is a bad idea. You know what? We're going to we're going to turn this off. And uh we're going to play a different game. Because this... I'm just not feeling it. it. It doesn't give me the same feel that, like... What's an example? Like, PUBG or... I'm really not crazy for Fortnite. I, I hate Apex. To me, that game is just way too messy. Um, in Warzone. I like games like Warzone. Or, like, Blackout. Where it's very, like... There isn't so much to it. And, like, there isn't that much to this, but there's just enough that separates this from games like Warzone that is kind of, it kind of turns me off to it. Like, it, it, they're going for a straight-up Battle Royale type thing, but it doesn't really feel like that. And, like, the fact that, that this is not Battle Royale mode... And then they added a mode called Battle Royale, which is literally the same fucking thing. It's a little weird. I mean, this is, I'm pretty sure this is like an independent company that made this. I don't think it's very... Well, no, I think, didn't Havoc work on this? No. I don't know. But, I'm done with it. You saw it. Wasn't great. If you liked it and want me to play more, I will. But, I kind of have a feeling that's not going to happen. So, I will hop onto another game and start recording that. I'll probably still put this out, um, but it's not great. I might not. I might just do two other recordings and just scrap this one. We'll see. I'm still going to save it. Anyway, whatever. We'll see you in the next one.